Good morning. So I am up and at it this morning. And I am cooking me some breakfast. So for breakfast, I'm cooking me some scrambled eggs with the onions and spinach and some cheese. And then I'm going to eat that with the salsa. And then I'm going to have me an English muffin on the side with some cream cheese and jelly. Cream cheese and jelly. Just in case y'all didn't hear me while I was closing up. So I guess I'll talk a little bit about my second trimester while I'm cooking this up. Everything is going by so fast. And the second trimester is kind of like a blur for me at this point. I mean, one thing that I know that's, that was really prevalent was my aches within my hips and pelvis area increased which made some nights of sleeping very challenging. Uh, so yeah, I know that's definitely one thing that like, sticks out in my mind. Uh, urination increased for sure. And my little waddle, you know, little waddle, waddle uh, started to come about for sure. And another thing that I noticed in the second trimester that I just actually confirmed now that I'm in my third trimester is that my breasts I'm sure they're preparing for milk because there were times where I would feel like it was wet by my nipples and then I was like is my breast not leaking but like you know releasing fluid uh kind of in preparation for breast milk to form and like when was this I think last week or so um I think it was last week where I actually confirmed it because I saw it on my nipple. So that was super duper interesting to say the least. Um, so yeah, and of course, you know, I saw where I was growing more in the belly. And yeah, so my second trimester was definitely a blur. There's some other things that took place in my second trimester but I will cover that in a whole nother video okay um one thing that happened in my second trimester not technically like me physically but I got a doula so yes I am going to have a doula and I am so excited about that because I want that extra support because I do plan on having a natural birth as natural as possible, okay? So, um, I definitely wanted a doula for that. I'll put my English muffins in the toaster. But yes, yeah, so I definitely wanted a doula for that. And yeah, so... I'm super excited and you know right now all of this COVID is going on and like I know where I work is actually where I'm going to be delivering so I work in a hospital uh, and they had made you know a policy where only one person from the family can actually come within the room in the room now my due date isn't until May 17th so I'm really hoping that will change because we have my mom coming into town and you know, my best friend may be coming into town. I'm not sure because you know, uh, it's a risk to her as well. You know, flying and all that kind of stuff. So we'll see, but the most exciting thing is that I was nervous that my doula wouldn't be able to, but she is actually going to be seen as a part of the, you know, care team. So that's super exciting to know that I'm still going to be able to have her support. So yes, that's exciting. Uh, but yeah. But yeah, you guys, I mean, my second trimester was definitely a blur. I mean... 
my first trimester video, I just feel like your body is changing so much in the first trimester. So it's like a little bit more simple to gauge what's going on with your body. But in the second trimester and the third trimester, your body has adapted and it's just doing its thing. It's doing its thing, okay? Um, I might as well give you guys, I'll, I'll give you guys a third trimester update um, later on. But it's kind of the same ordeal. Like nothing too crazy. <laughs> Ooh. That's another thing. In my second trimester, uh, my sinus sy symptoms increase. So my doctor told me that, you know, in your, you know, pregnancy, it is a symptom to have increased sinus, you know, movement. And before I even got pregnant, I had all of, I already had some sinus little things going on. So, um, it's just a little bit extra. It's just a little bit extra right now. So, I am going to make me a hot chocolate. I'm using milk. So here is my breakfast. I am so excited. I'm about to I'm just tire it up, honey, because I am hungry. And so after I get done eating, then I'll probably show you guys my progress on the in bed nursery because I am so excited. So then once I get done eating, I'll definitely show you guys the progress that I've made on the in bed nursery. All right, bye. thank you for watching today i hope you guys enjoyed don't forget to hit that subscribe button and join the mdd family like and share this video with your friends your family your associates and i'll see you guys on the next video bye